Yo, what's going on guys, Chadley here, and today I just wanted to talk about some huge news that was just announced by Gearbox, because the other day, it seemed like the new Cartel anointment, so basically all the anointments that were introduced with Mayhem 2.0 and the Cartel event, those were confirmed to be leaving once the event ended. That was confirmed on the Gearbox forum, I believe, by somebody from Gearbox, and that actually caused a lot of outrage in the community. Because we really want these anointments to stay. They do a ton for build diversity. There's seriously so many new great options in there. Like the 390 anointment and the 150 under 50 radiation anointment. Those seriously offer so much build diversity. So people were pretty upset to see them leaving once June 4th came around. Especially a week after we're going to get the new takedown. So we only had a little bit to farm those. But just today, Gearbox finally announced that they are keeping those anointments in the game. Even though the cartel event is still going to go away on June 4th, the anointments are going to stay in the anointment pool. So you guys will be able to continue to farm those for the rest of the game, or at least until whenever down the line they decide to change anointments, if they ever do. But this is seriously some huge news, because once we also get the loot scaling, where some of these older weapons are gonna be much, much more viable, it's gonna offer so much more build diversity within the game for all characters. I have so many ideas of what I can do with these anointments and old gear, but we just haven't really been able to do that yet because the old gear has not been performing to what it should be in Mayhem 10. Basically Mayhem 8 and up, it hasn't been performing very well. In case you guys aren't aware, some of the anointments that were included with this would be like on action skill and spawn the healing pools. While action skill is active, grenade damage is increased by 150%. While action skill is active, weapon damage is increased by 200%. The 390 anointment, like I said, the 150 under 50 radiation anointment, the constant novas return health damage as damage back to the attacker, and all those sorts of things are staying in the game, and there are so many opportunities with those, so I'm really excited to see that, especially now that we have guaranteed anointments on Mayhem 10. It seriously makes life so much easier. Now... There is a lot of anointments now that we're going to have to kind of farm through to get the one that we want. But the guaranteed anointments on top of that really doesn't make it too bad in my opinion. All they really need to do at that point is just increase the dedicated sources, which I believe at some point in the future they will end up doing because that is an actual problem in this game right now. So yeah guys, this was just going to be a super quick video letting you guys know exactly what's going to be going on with these anointments here in the next week or two. So this is super exciting news, and if you guys want to stay tuned for all these build ideas that we're going to have, we're going to be posting a ton of builds once all the loot gets scaled here coming up. So definitely make sure you guys are subscribed to the channel, keep an eye out for those. Otherwise, check me out over on Twitch, we're live every single night right around 8 central. But have a fantastic day, and I'll catch you all in the next video. See ya!